All right, folks, this is James with The James Show. Welcome back. It's been a month. I haven't uploaded any videos. And I'm going to be working on compilations, reactions, educational videos. Well, maybe vlogging also. Anyways, how are you guys doing? Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel with notifications. Tell your mom, your dogs, your cats, your cousins, your friends. You know, come over, subscribe to the channel with notific notifications on. And let's just do this. And before I go on, I just want to tell you guys this video here went viral in Brazil a couple of years ago. Let's play the video. Oh, vocês podem ver então que lá onde tem aquela latinha de refrigerante tem uma entrada. This is an underground entrance that they found out about a couple of years ago in Brazil, in the city of Curitiba, if I'm not mistaken, in certain parts of Brazil. And this was built in the 1940s, I guess, and uh, when the German came to Brazil, something like that. It was an amazing finding because of the rain, strong rain, and they were refurbishing a house, right? And um, they found out that there was a tunnel below the house. Now, before I do go into this video... Man, that's crazy! Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so this this woman, you can see she's staring at the cloud and they're talking to each other like, is this a cloud? Is this not a cloud? In other words, this is not a fake video. This is probably the real thing. I'm not just sure that this is a cloud. It could be foam. Someone was maybe washing a dish, things got out of hand, I'm not too sure what happened here. But it's probably not a cloud, I've never seen a cloud do this. However, clouds have been acting really strange lately, uh, so it's not 100%, you know, it's, oh it's not a cloud, it is a cloud. What's really intriguing about this video is this part over here where you see the cloud is square shaped. There you go, square shaped. I had this video go viral. And I also uploaded it to the other channel. However, I'm going to explain what's going on here. Check this out. A glitch in the matrix or maybe something else. What the f is happening? Mm, gotta go get me out right so this is a meditation exercise this is what a lot of people emailed me I actually went after this video found some comments on reddit also and people are commenting that this is some sort of meditation exercise so it's not a glitch in the matrix for those who actually thought that I, I for a moment there was thinking what is going on here people are just staring nothingness, the sky, the floor, the trees. I guess it's some sort of exercise where you connect with nature, something like that. There's something going on. Man, what the hell is going on? My phone won't adjust to it. I can see the object is moved. There we go. It's like three moons, like it's telescope or something. It's weird. There's something near the moon that's shaped like a pyramid. He notices that there's something next to the moon shaped like a pyramid. This is what's most intriguing because that's something we can't see here through the video, but maybe he saw it with his naked eye. However, in a certain part of the video, there you go, he focuses, finally, he focuses with his camera, and there are at least three objects, I would say maybe four. If this is a reflection, number one, he would have to be behind a window, and I guess he's not. If he's in his porch, which appears, this is what it looks like, this is probably some sort of atmospheric effect or phenomena. Maybe the atmosphere is polluted, 
maybe there are ice crystals, whatever's going on here, it looks as if there are three objects, three moons, right? Although, the third one, the small one, which he says is shaped like a pyramid, does not look like a reflection or something like that. So there, and he says it's moved. So this is one of the best videos, one of the most intriguing videos I've ever seen of such phenomena, whatever is actually going on here. Now, just want to point this out. There you go. There is a window to the bottom right. You can see another object, which is a window, probably from his neighbor's house. And in this exact part, you can see he's this window isn't reflected there aren't two three windows so this is obviously this means that whatever is going on here with the moon it's not a reflection from the camera lens or whatever it is something that he could see probably with his naked eye which makes this even weirder whatever is going on here now talking about the moon there's this video that went viral last week I guess uh, I'm not sure exactly from when this video is. Let's just roll the video. So there's music in the background, right? But there's a sound, like an alarm or something like that, right? This is the first red flag. If this video was just wind or birds chirping, it would be perfect. This sound that you hear is usually used by a, a YouTuber who goes by the name of HS or something like that. He's a really good uh, CGI or computer graphics designer or whatever. He's really good at what he does. And this really looks as if it's something that was done by him. In other words, this is fake. This is computer graphics. and. But it's really well done. If you take a look at this part, you can actually see the particles and all those things. And that's not the moon, whatever it is. It's some sort of, it's supposed to be another thing in our sky, in our atmosphere, whatever. It's not something that you could say it's real because if it were, it would be on 300 other videos in social media. This, when I watch something like this, I really remind, it reminds me of videos and movies I've watched with Brad Pitt, Superman, like and uh, talking about Superman. This is a video from Instagram TV from Henry Cavill, the actor, Superman. I guess this is Superman, I could be mistaken, uh, but I guess I'm not. So he is doing something that I've done myself before. He's really good at it. I never would guess or imagine that he, this guy is good at mounting computers really interesting but at this exact moment in the video there's something weird going on with his reflection in the window check this out do you see it or do you want me to point it out there is a face in his window and it's not it doesn't appear to be a reflection and why do i say that because at certain moments when he's passing in front of the window in front of the camera you can actually see the object is still there there you go so if this is a mask that he has hanging in his house it's as creepy as it can get and maybe this is why he shut his curtains he said, wait a minute, people are actually seeing that I have a bizarre mask in my room. Let me just shut the curtains. Or this is indeed someone or something that was watching him all along. Oh my God. Yeah, get out of your house right now and look. You guys, this is... The... Yo, Holy... Do you know what's happening you know right now? The highway stop for... The highway stop for this. Whatever this object is, it's glowing in the horizon. This happened in Ontario, Canada in 2018. There's helicopters all over right now. There's helicopters all over it. And um, 
this video was posted all over social media, so this is real. There were other people posting the same thing. It looks as if it's the moon, but it isn't. It's glowing in a certain pattern. They're saying there are helicopters flying over it. Now, what he over-exaggerates here, over-reacts, is that the highway stopped for it. Yeah, maybe, maybe some cars actually stopped to see it, but not all of them. And um, whatever this object is, at a certain moment here, you can see it almost... It almost disappears and then it goes and goes a little bit more another video that was posted from ontario canada i guess in the same year and this is what's crazy about all this in port alma from trevor thompson check this out so everybody saw the pictures i posted and i had to come out and see it for myself uh this is out towards port alma if you're familiar with the area you know where it is it. There's my foot. It's it's pretty crazy. I wish I mean even the videos, the pictures don't do it justice. This one of the reasons they don't do it justice is because the camera quality isn't that good, or maybe the quick the camera quality was good, but the video was so much reposted in social media, Instagram, Facebook that it got recompressed. Uh, there's a moment here, let me just put it. Waist height, like the difference between those two spots is almost waist height. And the crack that you can see goes down another, that's over my head, top to bottom is over my head. And there's one, two, and then there's another crack here. And then another crack here. And that's the... Well, oh, that's the, that's the big, that's head height, right there. Yeah, that's, I'm looking level at the ground now. Goes on for another 100 meters, at least. This is impressive how Trevor was brave enough to be in this place uh, while this happened, or just after this happened. I guess I wouldn't have the, the same uh, idea. I mean, like if I maybe fly a drone over it, but I wouldn't go and step in this place because there's a really, really mighty big chance that it just falls into the ocean. But this is IMAD Magician. And what he's about to do next is, is impossible. I will show you something crazy. Are you ready? Yes. One, two. <laughs> No. Hi. <laughs> How do you do that? I will show you something crazy. Are you ready? Yes. One, two. <laughs> no. Hi. <laughs> How? How do you do that? All right. So there's this video from Spain, I guess. Let's just roll the video. Uy, ¿qué es esa onda? Ah. No, espérate, me tengo que acercar, me tengo que acercar. ¿Qué? Uy. ¿Qué será eso? No entiendo. ¿Qué es eso? Uf, nunca había visto eso. Uh, uh. Se está subiendo. Suave, 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 que no se me pierda de vista. Nunca había visto eso. Alright, so in this video, a man supposedly captures a creature, he's actually narrating what he's seeing, so it could be real, right? However, in this exact moment, you can see the creatures light up to the church. Do you see that? It slides up. It doesn't walk. So, I mean, like, the shadow is perfect, the time frame is perfect, everything is perfect. It's impressive. The frame rate of the creature is perfect. It's 24 frames per, per second and it's it's it really look that. Look at that. Everything it seems like it's all there. However, when the creature does this, it slides there. There's a bit of an error. See that? In the computer graphics. 
Now, I'm not saying that these kind of creatures do not exist. There was a sighting in Santiago, in 100 kilometers from Santiago, Chile, uh, in 2008, I guess. This is a creepy video. I will explain in just a second, but this is Super Car Blondie. Rolls Royce of the future, right? She's awesome. She always makes nice videos of futuristic cars. I don't know how or when this car will be available for us, but uh, there is no steering wheel, like she's gonna say that here. This car is fully autonomous. Now, what you could say is Rolls Royce has been. And it's not always. It's not just fully autonomous. It has artificial intelligence with it. It's going to be controlled with artificial intelligence. I'm Eleanor. Oh, hi. The Rolls Royce Spirit of Ecstasy. I know from your diary that you are due to attend a rather special charity auction in aid of the Governor's Foundation. So, you know, this is something that I was wondering to myself. When are fully ultimate autonomous cars going to be available? Why? It, it is sad that this when this when this video went viral it is said that this is a girl that was cursed and she was removing her curse with a witch doctor right I'm not sure if this is in China whatever this is but the video really appears to be real as if he's removing some sort of uh, thing from her face right you don't see any holes anything that is left in her some of the reasons I think this video is fake is because look at that when he removes whatever that is her face is perfectly normal and uh, there's a certain moment there you can actually see right now I guess it looks as if he's gonna put his other hand in her head and he reaches out for his other hand right now and that is the moment I believe he just pretended as if there's something in her but he's it's a slight it's a, a trick it's a sleight of hand it has to be, you know, it's just too creepy not to be. Now in this next video, there's a man in the middle of the woods. He hears strange sounds and he goes after the sound and obviously he sees something that wasn't supposed to be there. Now most of these videos are fake. The person usually sees the creature and starts running and screaming and then the video ends. Usually these kind of videos are very much questionable not always although because if you do encounter something in the middle of the woods that's not supposed to be there there's a big chance you will scream and run however this video it's a bit different with akil or abdul rahim i guess check this out He's speaking a language I do not understand exactly what he's saying. I have checked with uh, friends of mine who will translate this and send me a transcript. But if you do understand what he's saying, please leave a comment. At 4 minutes and 48 seconds, this is what happens. Check this out. Did you see that? Wow, that is that was uh, wow. I'm not even sure what to say. This here, you you hear the sound. There was a sound, a noise, and I guess it's coming from a chicken or some sort of animal like that. And that's the animal. When at first he finds, you can see some sort of shape. It's moving. That's the animal. I guess that's the chicken or whatever it was that was making the sound. Check this out. So he points his flashlight towards the animal right now, I guess. Right now. You see that white thing over there? That's the animal. Now just next to it, this is what he finds. There, there it is. 
Its eyes are glowing, and whatever that w that thing was, I guess that's not normal. Now, what makes me think about this video? Is it real? Is it fake? He doesn't run. He doesn't run. He doesn't scream. Nothing at all. No normal reaction when it's a fake video. I would react the very same way probably because if I see anything like this in the middle of the woods, I would never scream and run because I don't want it to know that I saw it at the first place. I don't want this creature to know that I saw it. And this is exactly what he does. There's another possibility that he was taping this thing. He was f pointing his flashlight and he was looking the other way. Maybe after, when he was editing the video, he saw the creature and posted on social media and the, me the video went viral. So there's always a possibility, there's always a strange possibility, we never know. The thing is, he didn't react in a normal way when it's usually fake. Leave a comment, what do you think about this? I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, leave a like. See you guys again.